Well, good morning, Get Wrecked for Recovery crew. So it's day 62 of the Redeeming Eden Cycle Tour, R-E-C-T, Get Wrecked for Recovery, a bicycle trip up the Atlantic coast of America, plus four bonus states, to bring awareness that there are addiction recovery options available, that you don't have to die in your addiction. There's churches, celebrate recoveries, and rescue missions all over the nation, all over the world, that just wanna help you, talk to you, and love you if you find yourself battling addiction. So I'm here at Whitewater Adventures. I'm fully suited up, got the dry suit on, and this is Gordy. Hi guys, welcome to Ohio Pilot State Park. Today Adam's going to be taking a little break from biking today, and we're going to take him rafting on a nice, beautiful seven and a half mile trip down the Lower Yakagani, which also runs along the bike trail the entire way on the Great Allegheny Passage, also the trail known as the Gap. It's a beautiful trail that goes from Pittsburgh to DC with Ohio Pile right in the middle. So if you're ever on that trail, feel free to stop in and go rafting with us. Man, you're a professional. <laughs> it's like you've done this several times before. Thanks, Gordy. Of I'm course. excited. Got the GoPro ready. Let's go.
Alright. It does look like the river just down. Yeah. Yeah, it can go somewhere, I guess. So which way are we going? We'll go kind of to the left around this curved rock. Alright. Wow, well that was absolutely amazing. Uh, just so cool. Uh, both Courtney and Zorb got out at like the first little loop section uh, and then just me and Gordy rode the rest and we got to see so many things. He taught me so much about uh, the river and about the area. It was just amazing. We got to see a bald eagle, a heron, um, so many birds. Like, it was just, it was surreal. Like there was nobody on the river totally quiet perfect weather perfect day water felt good everything was amazing thank you so much jim and whitewater adventures here in ohio pile if you are riding the uh gap trail definitely stop in and take a ride on this river it is well worth it these guys will treat you right awesome awesome now i got to get on the bike and ride 40 miles <laughs> let's go
All right, so I just stopped here in Connellsville at the Yawk Park on the Yawkahaney River. Uh, I had my pizza for the day. Jim Murray gave a donation through Facebook, and he said, uh, you know, keep your daily pizza uh, coming. And I was like, this guy watches my channel. Uh, so, yeah, I had my daily pizza, uh, jalapeno roni. Uh, ate half of it. I've got half of it for dinner. It looks like there's not much between here and West Newton. West Newton is 22 miles away from where I'm at. Uh, there's a campground here. I'm not going to stay here. It's 4.49. Uh, but there's also a campground at the 99 mile marker and then one at the 110. The one at the 110 was the one I was going for. That would be 40 miles. But if I went to the 99 mile marker, then that would leave me 50 for tomorrow. And I literally have from the time I wake up until midnight to do 50 miles tomorrow. So... Probably going to stop at the 99 mile marker. I am very tired, like, waking up. I didn't rest well at all last night. Uh, I was super excited for the trip this morning. As a matter of fact, it got so cold last night that I had a dream that I called them when the birds started chirping and I went back to sleep. I had a dream that I called them called the uh, uh, you know uh, whitewater adventures and told them like i was working there hey guys i'm not gonna be able to make it in today uh it is just way too cold there's no way i can get out on the river uh it's the strangest dream and then like i woke up again later on and i was like no tell me i didn't <laughs> and i didn't uh so yeah it was cold and uh, i did not rest well at all so i think that's what i'm gonna do but my belly is full now, so I can get back on the road and keep some energy going here. And, uh, yeah, you'll see more of that right about now. I haven't had the GoPro on, like, at all, very much at all. But there has been some beautiful stuff. I would say I've now passed 70 waterfalls. I've only taken, like, video of two or three because I pass them, and I'm like, if I stop again now, I'm never going to get to where I'm going. But uh, this section of the gap has just been absolutely beautiful. And then it drops into Connellsville, like right through downtown like the last time i've been in a town like in a town the path has gone through a town i can't even remember being in a town at all at any point since the cno i've gone adjacent to towns but this one goes right through the town so uh that was a strange like back to reality thing i guess cumberland i had to kind of take a jaunt across the river but still uh anyway yeah getting on the road love you guys see you later so that's it for the day uh ended up going just to the 99 mile marker and i have no signal whatsoever like i've got the little triangle and the x nothing there is nothing no connectivity uh so yeah just kind of not going to be able to upload a video tonight um but i will go ahead and get it all produced and ready uh, so that you guys can see it and uh yeah yeah, I'm going to go ahead and start working on that video now. It's only like 7.30.
Uh, and I've just got quiet, reflective time ahead of me. It has been such a wonderful day. So thankful again for Whitewater Adventures. Jim and Kim and Gordy and Courtney and Zorb and everybody else. Uh, Ryan, who I met last night. Um, everybody else who has just poured their love on Redeeming Eden um, last night and today. I, I appreciate you guys so much. Uh, I really did enjoy whitewater rafting the yawk the yawkahaney river it took me two days to figure that out if you'll realize like if you go back and watch i called it this river or you know whatever i had no idea and i was not going to butcher it probably still am but i've had enough of you know the people around me saying it now to where i'm like okay uh, anyway yeah so that's it for the night i got 51 miles to do from this point tomorrow between tomorrow morning whenever i get up and start moving and midnight 11.59 p.m. is when my train leaves from Pittsburgh to Buffalo. Uh, so I've got to be on the midnight train. He's leaving, leaving on that midnight train. It's on a midnight train. Yeah. Um, not Georgia, though. <laughs> uh, by tomorrow evening, tomorrow night. And, uh, yeah, it's supposed to rain all day, too, so it's going to be just kind of a nice, easy... I mean, I could probably do five miles an hour, just literally just take my time and get there. I don't want to roll in there too early to where, like, I, ha I would have to get a room or anything like that. Uh, but I also don't want to, like, sit at the train station for, uh, you know, however many hours. I'd really kind of like to be rolling in right as it gets sunset there in Pittsburgh and just go right over to the train station, start cutting and edit editing the video from tomorrow in the lobby and getting this one posted if I haven't found a you know time or place to do that yet. Um, and yeah, that's it. I'm not going to keep this long. If you know anybody who's passed away from addiction in any form or fashion, please drop their name in the comments or find me through the pop link in the description. And I would love to ride for your person and celebrate their life with you for a day. If you know anybody who is actively addicted, please share this with them. I don't want to see anybody else die from addiction. I know you don't either. Let's use Redeeming Eden as a tool that we might save a life. This is the REACT Tour, R-E-A-C-C-T, the Redeeming Eden Atlantic Coast Cycle Tour, and I need you to react. I need you to like the videos, comment on the videos on YouTube, share the videos on your social media profile, and don't forget to subscribe to the YouTube channel. All those things will go a long way in helping to build Redeeming Eden, the Garden Rehab. Last but not least, don't forget Redeeming Eden is a non-profit ministry through International Gospel Outreach. I will leave a link to them in the description. You can go there and you can find out more about Redeeming Eden. You'll see my bio on their website. And about the Cody Jordan Forever Funeral Fund. Or you can go back and watch the day one video from this series, The React Tour. So yeah, from here in a chicken coop on the Yawkahaney, at the 99 mile marker, on the gap. I love you guys. Jesus loves you. I'll see you later. Have a good night.